I S U P K. They try to tell me I can't win all because of the skin I'm in. But then I look in the mirror again, and then we realize we better than them. We better than them. They divided and they conquered my kin But separated by the pigmentation of our skin It's just that white supremacy agenda again They want your mind and gold, cutting sugar cane, turning cotton jigs We left the plantation, then they pushed us into tenements Police patrolling, hunting all my people like we're venison The government's the criminals, they the real terrorists Moving more coke than a Cuban watching pelicans Selling all the dope, trying to kill us with the medicine You a slave if you think that we're American America was great before the pilgrims at a settlement, Trump gets an office, blacks uniting with the Mexicans, black Hispanic Haitians, Jamaicans, we all relatives. Shalom, Port of Spain. We are the ISUPK coming out of Bourne West, 125th Street, Harlem, New York, under commanding General Lehana. The ISUPK is not affiliated with any religious group or organization. Today, Port of Spain, what you have to understand is the Christian Church will not teach you what is in this Bible. In this Bible, there are laws, commandments, and statutes for you to follow. And if you don't follow that, you will be under all the other nations that are upon the face of the earth. Right. What you don't understand is that the, you, as Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you are to keep the most high laws, commandments, and statutes. Right. You are not to be intermingling with all these other nations, all these other races, and their culture, their history, and their high holy days, their Salakia, their holidays. Right? Give me what you have. The book of Amos chapter 3 and verse 1. Go ahead. Hear this word that the Lord had spoken against you, O children of Israel. Hear this word that the Most High had spoken to you, O children of Israel. The children of Israel is you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians. Not those that wear the black hats with the squiggly pig tail on the side of their head over in, in Israel right now. You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you are the lost 12 tribes of the nation of Israel. Right. You are the two Jews of this Bible. Right. Go ahead. And of God. Against thee, Salaki, against the whole family, which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, Go ahead. You only. You what? You only. Most sides letting you know that you only, you only so called black man, Hispanic man, and native Indian man. Go ahead. You only have I known. Of all the families of the earth. The Most High saying that out of all the families of the earth, you only have me known. So called black man, Hispanic man, and native Indian man. Go ahead. Of all the families of the earth, mm -hmm. therefore I will punish you. Therefore you will do what? I will punish you. You will do what? I will punish you. Go ahead. For all your iniquity. And when we sin against the Most High, black man, Hispanic man, native Indian man, the Most High is going to punish us for all our sins. What you don't understand is when we go into the Christian church, we are not going into the Bible. Give me, give me. They're not going to go into the Bible and show you that you have laws, commandments, and statutes to keep. They are not going to show you that you are not supposed to be celebrating the holidays of this world. Most I give you high holy days to follow, high holy days to celebrate. What you have to understand, so-called black man, Hispanic man, and native Indian man, that the most I chose you to be a holy people unto himself. Go ahead, read. The book of Deuteronomy. Chapter 28 and verse 9. Go ahead. The Lord shall establish thee and holy people. The Most I say that he is going to establish you, so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian, a holy people. Meaning what? A separate people. Go ahead, read. Unto himself. Unto who? Unto himself. Unto himself. Not unto all these other nations. Not unto all the gods of these other nations. But unto himself. Go ahead. As he had had sworn unto thee. As he had what? Sworn unto thee. Go ahead. If thou shalt keep the commandments of the Lord thy God. So if you are to keep the commandments of the Most High God, the Most High said that he's going to establish us a holy nation, a separate people unto himself. Go ahead. And walk in his ways. Go ahead. And all people of the earth mm -hmm. shall thou art be called, Salakia, shall see that thou art called by the name of the Lord. And all people of the earth shall see that we will be called by the name of the Lord. Go ahead. And they shall be afraid of thee. And they shall what? Be afraid of thee. And when you look around today, are these other nations afraid of us? No, they are not afraid of blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians. We are at the bottom right now. We are serving them. 
we don't understand that in this land that we are here, that this is not our home, this is not our rest. Right. Because we sin against the most high, right. we fell from the rightful place that we ought to be. Give me from verse 1. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, and verse 1. Go ahead. And it shall come to pass, mm -hmm. if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God. So if you was to hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God, unto the things that the most high told us to do. Go ahead. And if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe and to do all his commandments. And we were supposed to observe and do all the commandments of the Most High. Go ahead. Which I command thee this day. Go ahead. That the, uh, that the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. And if you was to follow the Most High laws, we was to be above all nations upon the face of the earth. We was to be above all nations, all races upon the face of the earth. Go ahead. And all these blessings shall come unto thee. And the most I said to us, no, if you was to keep his laws, the same laws that the Christian church said, I don't know where it. We was to do what? And all these blessings shall come over on thee. All these blessings was to come upon us. Go ahead, read. And overtake thee. Mm -hmm. If thou shalt hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. So all these blessings were supposed to come upon us and take us if we was to hearken unto the voice of the Most High. Good. Verse 3. Blessed shalt thou be in the city. We were supposed to be blessed in the city. When we walk around in the city today, we see these other nations are blessed. Look at all the establishments. These other nations own all these establishments and we have to do what? Go work for them. Go serve them. We are not blessed in the city. Go ahead. Blessed shalt thou be in the field. And we were supposed to be blessed in the field also. But due to our, our, our disobedience to the Most High, not keeping His Lord's commandments and statutes, we are cursed. We are not blessed in the field. Our forefathers were whipped in their backs in the cotton field, picking cotton and doing all manner of slave work for these other nations. Right, That's right. Blessed shall, bless shall be thy basket and thy store. And our baskets and our storehouses were supposed to be blessed. You're not supposed to be on food stamps. You're not supposed to be on food cards and all these different food programs that they have out here. We're not supposed to be on that so-called black man, Hispanic man, and Native Indian man. Right, right. Why? Because we're supposed to be keeping the Lord's commandments and statutes of the Most High to be above all nations upon the face of the earth. Right. right. That's right. right. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 15. Go ahead. But it shall come to pass, if thou wilt not hearken, Unto the voice of the Lord thy God. And if he was not hearkening unto the voice of the Most High, your power, go ahead. To observe and to do all his commandments. To observe and to do all his commandments. The same thing that the Christian church have you so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians doing. Not observing the Most High Lord's commandments and statutes. And this is what is going to happen to us by us not observing his laws. Go ahead, read. Which I command thee this day. Go ahead. That all these curses, all these what? All these curses, all these curses, go ahead, shall come upon thee and overtake thee. So, by us not listening to the Most High laws, curses came upon us, so called black man, Hispanic man, and Native Indian man. We don't understand when we don't keep the laws of the Most High that we are cursed people in the eyes of the Most High. Verse 16, go ahead, cursed, thou be in the city, and we will be cursed in the city. Again, look at all the establishments having here. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you don't own nothing in the city. Right. You have to go to the hands of these other nations for, for, for them to feed you, for them to give you the things that you need. You are to work under them. You are cursed in the city. Go ahead, read. And cursed shall thou be in the field. No difference from in slavery. We were cursed in the field. We were cursed under the hands, serving under the hands of our enemies, serving under the hands of our oppressors. No difference from today. When we go to work, we don't understand where the hell our money is going. We are cursed in the field. We are living paycheck to paycheck. Cursed shall be thy basket and thy store. And look at us today. We are on all manner of food programs here in Trinidad. We are on TT cards. We are on food stamps. We, are, we, 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 we don't have enough for our bad bread basket and our store. Verse 37. And thou shall become an astonishment, a proverb, and a byword. And you so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you was to become astonishment, a proverb and a byword in the eyes of all these other nations. You are the ones that they are calling niggers. You are the ones they are calling 
cockroaches, That's rats, right. and pests. That's right. You are to become an astonishment, a proverb, and a byword. Go ahead, read. Among all these nations. Among who? Among all nations. Among all these nations, this is who you so called black man and Hispanic, Hispanic man, native Indian man are. You are a proverb and a byword. Give me a question. Verse 43, the stranger that is within thee shall get up above thee very high. And guess what? The strangers among us, meaning these other nations, is going to get up above us very high. Because we're not hearkening unto the commandments, laws, and statutes of the Most High Power. Go ahead, read. Sure. And thou shalt come down very low. And guess what? You so called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you are to come down very low. You have all the low end jobs. You have all the jobs underneath all these other nations. You work and serve these other nations. Go ahead. He shall lend to thee, and thou shalt not lend to him. And guess what? In your, in your community, black man, in your nation, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, you are, cannot lend to these, these other nations. You have no power to lend to these other nations. But That's these right. other nations have the power to rule over us, to give to us, to have us in servitude to them. Right, That's right. right. And he shall be the head. And he shall what? And he shall be the head. Go ahead. And thou shall be the tail. And guess what? These other nations will be the head of you, so-called black man. And you will be the tail. You will be, you will be tossed to and fro. You will be underneath and serving them to whatever they throw for you. Go ahead, read. Moreover, mm -hmm. all these curses shall come upon thee. And pursue thee. Go ahead. And overtake thee. Go ahead. Till thou be destroyed. And all these curses here listed in the book of Deuteronomy 28 will overtake you, so called black man. Pursue you. Don't matter which part you are, show the four corners of the earth. These curses will pursue you and overtake you. Go ahead. Because thou hearkenest not unto the voice of the of the Lord thy God. Because you don't want to listen to the voice of the Lord thy God. You don't want to listen the most high laws, commandments, and statutes that he has laid out for you. Go ahead, read. To keep his commandments. To do what? To keep his commandments. To keep his laws, commandments, and statutes. The same laws that the Christian church said done away with. You have to keep the dietary laws. You have to keep the most high high holy days. You are supposed to know all these laws, commandments, and statutes to be above all nations upon the face of the earth. Go ahead, read. And the statutes which he commanded thee, and they shall be upon thee, for a sign. This shall be upon thee for what? For a sign. And guess what so called blacks, Hispanics and Native Indians? These curses are upon you for a sign. This, this is how you can identify who the real Jews are. This is how you can identify who the Hebrew Israelites of this Bible are. Go ahead, read. Right. And for a wonder. Go ahead. And upon thy seed forever. And once you're not keeping the Lord's commandment statute of the Most High, it was going to follow your seed forever. Give me verse 64. The book of Deuteronomy chapter 28. And verse 64. Go ahead. And the Lord shall scatter thee among all people. And guess what? We were scattered among all people. We, the true biblical Jews, the Hebrew Israelites, we were scattered among all people. Go ahead. From one end of the earth. Go ahead. Even unto the other. Even unto the other. Go ahead. And there thou shalt serve other gods. And we were served, we were, when we were scattered into all other nations, there we were to serve other gods. Go ahead. Which neither thou nor thy fathers have known. We was to serve gods which our forefathers have not known and which we ourselves do not know. Go ahead, read. Even wood and stone. Even wood and stone, meaning the Christian cross, the Christian church, and the cobbler stone that these Muslims walk around and kiss. We was to be in these other relations, in, in, in these other um, religions. We was to serve these other religions. Go ahead, read. And among these nations, thou shalt find no ease. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 68. Go ahead. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. The Lord shall do what? Bring you into Egypt again. Egypt meaning bondage. Meaning that you was to come into bondage again. Go ahead, read. With ships. With what? With ships. And this is how we came from West Africa into these other nations. We were right. brought across, across here on cargo slave ships. Right. Go ahead, read. By the way, Therefore I speak unto thee. The same way the most I said it was going to happen, is the same way that it happened. Go ahead, read. Thou shalt see it no more again. And he was not going to see your homeland no more again. Go ahead, read. And there ye shall be sold. And in that place where you was 
transported in cargo slave ships, you was to be sold. You was not, you was not, you not, you did not travel there on your own. You was to be sold, go ahead. Unto your enemies. Unto what? Unto your enemies. You was to be sold unto your enemies. You was not given to your family members. You was not given to your friends. When you came here, you were sold unto your enemies. Go ahead. For bond men. For slave men. And bond women. And slave women. And no man shall buy you. And guess what? No man, so-called blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian man, was to free you. No man would have freed you from your slavery. No what? man was to free you from what the Lord said will happen to you. What? what we need to do as blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian is to come back, keeping the laws, the Lord, laws, commandments, and statutes. Definition of prejudice, got a right to be hesitant. As the African Methodists, we the endangered species, they'd rather protect the elephants. We the sons of God, like a seraphim. God chose the people from the Old and New Testament. Black power, Kwong Yasha Allah, black excellence. We your new rulers, bow down to your eminence. They try to tell me I can't win, all because of the skin I'm in. But then I look in the mirror again, and then we realize we better than them. We better than them. They try to make you think rich. Why? To make your whole life a big risk. So what you do? Commit a crime, get locked up, come home, can't get a job. Man, that shit just make you think bricks. They trash you. Ain't no way out of this poverty. Fuck being the prodigy, because the world say you ain't shit. And then they give you religion as soon as all that fails They like to make you feel it ain't this, it's you So what you do, you just can't get it right Yeah, they like to say the truth hurts, but watch me take a life And they like to keep you in darkness so you can't get the Christ Not knowing like Jacob's sons, he is real light, get it? So